Okay, hey, 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 my peeps, what it do? So, you know what time it is. If you watched my last video, you know I went in with the Megami cables. With the Megami Gold Professional Studio XLR cables. I reviewed that for my peeps yesterday. I went in detail, I brought up the web pages, and I went in, and we executed a really, pretty much a thorough review of the Megami Professional Studio cables. Um, if you watched that, the last video, that's what that was about. And if you watched the video before that one, then you know about the package I received from Sweetwater where I had purchased three different things. I had bought some cables and I had bought two other things. And today we're going to review the second item. Yet the other video, we did the cables. This one, we're going to do something else. And as you can see, we already got it there for you to see what we're about to dive right up into. Um, so like, and if you watch my last video, you more than likely understood that I gave you the presentation of like what kind of person I am, my ideology and my philosophy of how I present things to my peeps, to you, my peeps. So like when I purchase a product, right? I just want to be authentic with my peeps. I just want to keep it 100. You know, I don't want to beat around the bush. I don't want to be biased or anything like that. I just want to just keep it 100. I want to be authentic. And like when I watch uh, people do reviews on YouTube and then, you know, they be like, oh, you know, I already opened the package. I played around with it, you know, I already reviewed it, you know. It just doesn't feel authentic, right? Like it just doesn't feel authentic. Um, but like for me, I feel like if I was to open this up for the very first time and you're doing it with me, it just feels realer. It just feels more original, it just feels more authentic, right? I mean, that's just the way my mind works, my philosophy, my ideology, but a, hey, I would really like to know what you think by dropping a comment down below. Let me know, you know, if it makes sense to you or not, you know, if my ideology makes any sense, open this up brand new instead of opening it up as if like it's brand new, which one sounds more authentic to you? Like just drop a comment um and like and subscribe if you like to see more videos like this so i went ahead and chose this microphone over many other microphones this one intrigued me the most it was either this one or the origin the spirit the origin or some other microphone. I was thinking about a Newman, and I was like, "Yeah, I really don't feel like paying the thousand, two, three hundred dollars price tag for the damn mic. Then I gotta buy the damn interface. Yeah, you know, like, cause I'm not. I didn't want to go. I didn't want to go low budget on anything anymore. You know, like I told you guys in the other video, in my first video when I got the box the whole box from uh, Sweetwater I showed you this is what I usually use when I record my music this is what I usually use a USB microphone that's what this is that's what I usually use it's a I don't even know it's a U37 something it's it's a cheapo and it came to a point where I just stopped recording music I just stopped recording stop writing i have nothing to write about because i'm the person that when i get when i make a song it's because it's real it's authentic that's just who i am so like when i write a song it's obviously gonna be about whatever i'm going through at the moment 
you know, or something might happen in my life that brings up old um, situations and maybe I'll tell a story, you know, that's just how I usually write my songs. I just don't make up a whole bunch of bullshit most of the time. Excuse my language, but I just try to keep it 100. I don't try to fake fake it till I make it. Like that's just not me. <laughs> so I I went ahead and dove in and got the spirit, and we're gonna um, you know, we're gonna go. It's really nice cardboard. Um, it has a sleeve, and does it say anything special? It says Austin microphones, um, spirit, multiple pattern condenser mic, omni, cardioid, and figure of eight with negative 10 to negative and negative 20 dB pads and 80 hertz bass cut. Wow. Like this is, a, this is, that, that's what intrigued me is like all the, all the, technology they put into this microphone this one is about five years old maybe give or take and the origin is like older than that i believe and like this this one has a built-in pop filter and more like you see what i'm like it has a built-in pop filter and more like come on who else is doing that they're innovating they're creating new they're creating things that no one else has create it right so why not invest into pretty much probably one day they might be the best you feel what the way they're moving the way they making moves i wouldn't doubt if they become better than newman one day okay i'm just that's just my perspective right now um so we're going to go ahead and we're going to be authentic because that's just what I, I do. And we're going to go ahead and open this up. So, so there's a sleeve. There's a sleeve. If I could get it off. <laughs> Jesus. It's one hell of a sleeve. It's tight. So on here it says. Oh, it has a warning. Oh, so yeah, that's so this cardboard and this cardboard feel way different. This is smoother and everything because it says environmental friendly, 100% recyclable, no harm to nature. So yeah, it's environmental friendly cardboard. On here it says the art of audio and it has a Austin microphone symbol and label on the front on the top of the box and it just says austin microphones and the art of audio and we're just gonna go ahead and open it up i guess um let's see here how do i open this okay it's one of those boxes that it seems like you gotta like pretty much like rip it open almost yeah i think it's one of those type of boxes where like you have to rip it open to open it or maybe not maybe i'm wrong yeah i'm wrong you don't have to rip it open to open it it has these things right here so yeah it was like this you know and <laughs> really confusing at first but i got it so when i open a box it says here i am it says here i am your new baby <laughs> here i am your new baby now you're part of the aston family don't forget to register me please so i get all the care i ever need austinmikes.com slash english slash my aston i guess that's where i'm supposed to register it at and it comes with the cool um aston microphones um sticker it's pretty cool looking it looks very glossy and premium you know this is probably going to be my collector's item i don't like to use stickers most of the time unless 
I find a purpose for it. And usually I don't find a purpose for stickers. I just collect them. Um, so under that, there's like, under the sticker, there's this little piece of cardboard. And then there's a little bag. It has like a little button of some kind. Yeah, it's like a button. A button, like, you know, like a, a button that you put on your shirt. <laughs> it's crazy, right? <laughs> like, they give you this cool metal button. I'm not sure if you can see it, but that's what it looks like. They give you a button, a metal button that you could put on, like, a shirt or something. That's cool. Um, it's thoughtful. And under that, there's a, um... pamphlet but it's an owner's handbook not a pamphlet it's the owner's manual and it's whoa 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 like this is they did not cheap out when it came to their owner's manual they didn't they didn't they just say hey we're gonna get the best quality paper huh wow like this has to like I mean, I'm a photographer, too, so, like, I know, like, printing photo paper, certain kind of photos paper, they can get expensive. And this is expensive photo paper. <laughs> so, they didn't cheap out. They really, it seems like they care about the quality, the overall quality of the presentation of their product when the customer receives it for investing into it. Like, it's there. And it has like thank you thing and using 84% recycled materials and being 100% Austin microphones are built using a tumble stainless steel body. So there is no paint work, no paint work to chip or scratch and legends are laser itched. Dang, laser itched. So will never wear off. Our packaging has been designed to save space and focus on being as environmental suitable as possible. Wow, like they really like went above and beyond in my opinion. Um, so I'll go through this handbook later to understand exactly what this microphone is able to do. Um, yeah, it's really neat, very quality um handbook right there and under the handbook we have whew, this thing right here i ain't never had nothing like this in my life until now wow this just feels like like i've reached another level in life So like, yeah. yeah, is there anything under this? I doubt it. Nope. So that's everything. So yeah, microphone. See, got to open it up for you. You feel me? It just feels more authentic this way. Like, if I was to do that without all the packaging, then it would just feel like, you know, kind of fake. Like, like, like a TV show or a movie. Like, like it's all premeditated and acted out. And I don't rehearse anything. Like, I just go off of my dome. Like, I freestyle everything because that's what I do on a microphone. Like, I know how to freestyle you. I know how to rap. So, that's just what I do. I like to go off the top of my dome. I love to research. I just, yeah, off subject. So, yeah, this is a very, very good-looking microphone. I never held a condenser mic in my life, actually. I never used a condenser mic in my life. I never used one. I never owned one. And this is the first time. So, it looks like it has a 20 dB, a 0 dB, and a 10... A, a 20 dB, a 0 dB, and a minus 10 dB um, option. So you go uh, right is the 
20 dB. The middle is the zero and the right is the minus 10 dB. And then they have the patterns. Something feels weird about this microphone, but um, <laughs> not weird, but just different. Like it's not weird. It's just like I never held one of these before. Like of course, like it's, it kind of feels like strange. But um, so you have the regular um pattern. So you have the pattern switch right here in the middle of the mic, and that's the regular face forward pattern, and then you have the pattern to the left and i think that's the omni pattern where it's from the front and from the back of the mic so so this is the front so i could be speaking from this side and someone else could be speaking from that side like an interview type and it will pick up from both ends and then they have a third one to the right side which is the figure eight and what the figure eight does is it records in a figure eight so it, it records all around the microphone basically like if you're going to do like a group session maybe i don't know like a group chat any anything with multiple people basically our instruments and things like that or maybe just some unique different kind of sound um experiments so different mic positions and stuff like that um then they have the uh the the uh the um bass which i'm gonna call it what they say it was called um bass um bass um i just read that didn't i it's not on the box is it it's the bass um 80 megahertz bass cut okay yeah so if you got too much bass in your voice then it's already it's set there already so it's set at the cut and that's just straight it in this it has a base cut and this is really premium looking i mean this looks nice smells clean mm, smells new look at that bad boy just look at it for a minute let's just let's just admire it right wow such a beauty so moving on let's dive into the research area so this is the spirit microphone the austin spirit is a high performance switchable pattern microphone using a one inch gold evaporated capsule a switch on the mic body selects from omni, cardioid, or figure of eight polar patterns. It is versatile enough to use with most instruments and excels on acoustic guitars and vocals. Its Aston 33 panel selection capsule is teamed with high-end transformer balance circuitry using only the best components. The Spirit is designed to deliver a beautifully open sound with sparkling harmonics. This highly accurate microphone gives a stunningly natural and transparent recording capturing all the details in the high range but without adding the harshness that some condenser microphones seem to um i guess they have some professional reviews by real people in the industry and so forth in magazines and they have a video here and i guess these are the things it says our mics are developed by a panel of top industry professionals producers engineers and artists unique design provides shock absorbent absorption to protect capsule with elastic memory <laughs> this, is, this is like crazy right like you see those waves in there like this thing is crazy dope right um built-in pop filter which i was mentioning before the spirit uses the latest in stainless steel mesh knit technology to dramatically reduce vocal plosives direct to stand mounting proprietary end cap design and ultimate capsule chassis isolation means the spirit can be di 
direct to stand mounted with virtually no handling noise so you don't necessarily need a shock mount for this at all it has a um you could screw it in right here on a regular stance like without a mount shock shock mount or anything like that you just screw it on and it'll stand on it and um this thing's pretty it's pretty cool to me the chassis two millimeter solid stainless steel laser cut and etched body pcb austin uses only market leading electronic components coupled with cutting edge original electronic design eco-friendly packaging we already know that the spirit represents the biggest engineering advancements in the microphone industry in decades see this is why i said aston might be the new newman in the future because they're actually innovating um nominated for the prestigious nam tech award in 2017 and universally acclaimed as one of the best mics on the market today at any price it achieves a level of technical excellence and performance before never never before seen at this price point i mean uh, the origin versus the spirit the spirit can be considered our pro mic option simply because of its revealing incredible polished sound its transformer based circuit gives oodles of headroom, which means more air and space to the sound and an incredible amount of detail and harmonic content. I mean, do I really need to go into the accessories and all this? I guess these are artists who use the mic themselves and producers and music creators. It says Steve Le Levine. Is that like Jimmy Levine's? Uh, relative <laughs> um so yeah there's that and then we have we're on 22 minutes and we know you could come here and check out the videos which i find kind of you know er i mean they're all right we know about the features the pop filter built in we know about a lot of this stuff already that i read to you i just want to get into what some of the people are saying i love the sound and the service a plus order yesterday and been using it all day non-stop thanks sweet water for the recommendation great addition i'm slowly building my mic locker and this was a amazing addition to it i came from a bluebird but when my friend let me try his spirit in my studio, I was blown away. Like, you know, it has nothing but good reviews. Like, I mean, right? Am I wrong? Ten reviews? Let's go to the review section. Let's see our reviews. Are there any one stars? I just want to. I just want to see. I'm not saying it's a bad mic. I just want to see so let's we're sorting by rating so there's one great marketing not so great mic 2018 from i don't know the spirit is a attempt to create a detailed transparent honest mic that allows you to uh, i don't know first mic i've ever returned after purchase for this price i recommend considering other similar price mics such as a Rode K2 Audio Technica 4050 and an AKG, which all I believe will do a better job. This mic is reminiscent of some of the better SC mics. The SC mic is referable as the quality is comparable, and you avoid the woven mesh grill and internal shock mount. These features do not add any value to the sound of this mic if you are not adverse to a thin typically british mic and don't mind paying more than what you probably should for a mic of this quality then this is the mic for you i was kind of like a weird i didn't read the whole thing but it just seemed like a little fishy to me um so yeah um this is the 
spirit by Aston. And I hope everyone has a wonderful day and a great evening and a good night. And I hope to see my peeps later because I have another box to open up and review for you. So please give me a like and subscribe and drop a comment if you want to comment. Peace out.